my thanks to bringing me to live radio, and welcome to the Cinema Scribe. At a time when it seems coverage of the global pandemic is virtually everywhere, it's hard to believe that there are those out there who can't seem to get enough about the subject, even when it comes to entertainment. Some, myself included, might find the notion somewhat maudlin or ghoulish. But each of us has our reasons, perhaps an interest in knowing more about the topic, or simply just having a morbid curiosity. In any event, for those who possess such an insatiable appetite for the material, there are three films available for home viewing that could help to shed new light on the subject. Those interested in a film that examines the concept of a pandemic from a comprehensive viewpoint might want to consider director Steven Soderbergh's 2011 release, Contagion. The picture looks at the subject from multiple angles, including the search for the disease's origin, the effect on victims and survivors, the work of researchers to find a cure, and the impact on everyday life. Viewers will likely find this offering to present a remarkably accurate and often chilling depiction of what we're experiencing, almost as if our current real-world situation is following the same script as that used to construct this film. Contagion features an impressive all-star cast including Gwyneth Paltrow, Matt Damon, Lawrence Fishburne, Jude Law, Marion Cotillard, Kate Winslet, Brian Cranston, John Hawks, Jennifer Ailey, and Elliot Gould. The curious are likely to walk away from this one with new insights into what's going on and what to expect, as well as wondering which side of the screen they find themselves on. Viewers interested in more typically commercial fare may find themselves drawn to filmmaker Wolfgang Peterson's 1995 blockbuster adventure, Outbreak. With a cast featuring Dustin Hoffman, Rene Russo, Morgan Freeman, Kevin Spacey, Cuba Gooding Jr., and Donald Sutherland, this big-budget extravaganza tells the tale of a virus run amok in a small northern California town and the measures employed to control its spread, including potentially drastic steps that threaten the lives of an entire community and that set a dangerous precedent, unless heroic researchers investigating the illness can step in before it's too late. Outbreak is the kind of popcorn thriller that has more than its share of incidents that at one time would have required a leap of faith but that no longer seem as implausible as they did when the film was originally released. Enjoy it, but don't be surprised if you end up feeling you're whistling in the graveyard by picture's end. Finally, on a more philosophical tone, there's director Luis Puenzo's 1992 French production of The Plague, originally titled La Peste. Based on a novel by existential author and philosopher Albert Camus, this release, like Contagion, examines the subject from multiple angles. But unlike that offering, the plague goes deeper, looking at the topic from the standpoint of personal interpretations. What exactly is the underlying cause of the pandemic? Is it merely something biological? Or is it something deeper, such as divine retribution for the sins of humanity? In addition, the film also probes the efforts of the picture's principal characters, providing perspectives on how they each see the incident. A medical emergency to be addressed, a news story to be covered, or a crusade to save man's souls before it's too late. With a cast that includes William Hurt, Robert Duvall, Raul Julia, and Sandrine Bonaire, the plague is certainly the most profound of these three offerings, and screening it should be reserved for a time when viewers can devote their undivided attention to it. This one may be a little more difficult to find than the other two, but it's worth the time, especially in an uncertain age such as this one, in which many of us find ourselves assessing the meaning of this phenomenon and what it may hold for our future. These options, admittedly, are not for everyone. In fact, for many of us, more escapist fare of another nature may be more fitting and appropriate. But, as the old saying goes, forewarned is forearmed, and the information imparted by these offerings may help to provide us with the knowledge and insights necessary for tackling the difficult situation. Just be careful not to make things any harder on yourselves than they already are. I'm Brent Marchant, The Cinema Scribe.
Thanks for listening. A lifelong movie fan and longtime student of metaphysics, cinema scribe Brent Marchant is the award-winning author of Get the Picture. Conscious Creation Goes to the Movies, Consciously Created Cinema, The Movie Lover's Guide to the Law of Attraction, and Third Real Conscious Creation Goes Back to the Movies, all of which provide reader-friendly looks at how the practice of conscious creation, also known as the Law of Attraction, is illustrated through film. Brett maintains an ongoing blog about metaphysical cinema and other self-empowerment topics through his website, www.brentmarchant.com. He's also the movie correspondent for the Good Radio Network and New Consciousness Review Magazine and Radio, with additional writing contributions to Smart Women's Empowerment, The Happy Guide, Library Journal, BeliefNet, Vivid Life, New Age News, and Master Heart Magazine. Brett holds a BA in magazine journalism and history from Syracuse University. Again, check him out at www.brentmarshop.com.